Alright guys, what is going on? This is Outdoor Tech. It is January 5th. It's 12.19 in the afternoon. The game plan for today is to do a little bit of some pheasant hunting. Now, a buddy of mine messaged me on Facebook saying that, you know, they just stocked, that the um, stocking truck rolled in. It's literally on there now, so this will be the first ever, like, this will be the first ever time that I'm actually hunting these game lands, like, right after they just stock so you know it's, it's just going to be an experience to see you know how quote unquote easy it can be i'm expecting to you know get two birds but you know whenever it comes to hunting nothing's a guarantee you still got to make shots and be at the right place at the right time so you know we'll see how it goes again you know i'm not normally one of those guys to be right behind the stocking truck but hey you know if you have the opportunity and the time why not so we'll see how it goes just looking to you know get another video up for you guys make it number 20 on the season so far i have 18 ring necks and i'm just looking to you know get two more and hopefully we just make a fun hunt taking a new gopro out let's do it i wonder how crowded these game layers are going to be knowing that the stocking truck's literally here Oh my god, yo look, got a freaking game warden, big cage on the back there, that's kind of cool, I never, I never even seen what this look like, what this looks like guys. Here's Mr. Green Jeans. It's a little crowded. Oh, that's sick. Wow. They were literally all flying in these fields. That is so cool, guys. That is awesome. I know where we're going to go. Everybody's going over here, but if we could go in this corner and then walk in the little gully here in these woods, we'll get them in the woods. Everybody's going to go in these fields. This isn't even gonna be a challenge, but park right up in here. All right. All right, guys, I think I have everything. Oh my God, they're shooting. All right, time to get in these woods. Oh, there's a freaking cottontail. Oh. Got him. Third shot, baby. That was a hen, too. Crazy. Where'd he go? There he is. I ought to put some shells in my gun here in case I see another one. Well, guys, this certainly takes the pressure off. Takes the pressure off, and guys, I literally, this is probably like my third or fourth hen only of the year. Pheasant number 19, but, you know, cool little hen. The way I got him, just flying fast through the woods, third shot. Let's go get her limit now. Put this in here. All right. Oh, I see him. Guys, there's a pheasant flying right at me. Got him. Thank you! 
<laughs> wow, what a beautiful ring neck too. Here he is. I mean, just beautiful freaking bird, guys. Five seconds literally after I got that hen, a guy had his dog. Dog flushed another bird. Look at this. Look at this. I could literally shoot that one if I wanted to. You guys could go after that one. I already got my two. Okay. He landed right there. I got my two also. Alright. Well guys. I, I think I'm 30 minutes in and you know, I already got my two pheasants. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's fun, but I just wish I could hunt more, but yeah. You know, it's only two birds a limit. One's literally flying over there. Both of my pheasants were flushed by other people. And you know, I just shot them flying through the woods, which, you know, doesn't really happen often for me. So, you know, it was just kind of a cool experience just to see them stock. And not only see them stock, but just see what it's like hunting oh my god there's more pheasants flying i don't know if you guys could see that i mean that's just unreal but you know i knew going into this that hunting the woods would be the you know best idea because they are all flushing right into the woods and you know again two birds already uh, my hunting's over so you know cool little pheasant video i'll be out probably tomorrow morning going for pheasants and then i I really want to get back into the flintlock hunting and steelhead fishing. Here, so. All right, I'm get I'm getting out of here before I get shot. Peace. These woods are like Vietnam right now, but there's a freaking ringneck. I'm walking out. Literally a ringneck sitting right up in that tree there, perched. I don't know if you guys could see it, but just goes to show you how loaded these game lands are right after they stock. I mean, it's like you wonder why they get picked off by hawks and predators it's behaviors like that so all right guys so here are the birds just like on the nice camera the first one was a hen the other one a beautiful ring neck with the tail just the amount of birds i saw flying it was kind of cool to see but at the same time you know it just it's kind of a shame that you know like 50 percent of the stocked pheasants it's like they die within the first hour you know i really think that they should come up with a better system you know easier said than done because you know, I don't know what the resources are in terms of stocking birds. You know, it's the game commission. It just got sunny for no reason there, but, you know, I don't know. You know, I, I, th I think that they should do a better job in terms of stocking pheasants so that they don't get killed within the first hour, whether it's making it more anonymous or stocking them at night. But then again, you know, I know that, you know, you have those older hunters that, you know, appreciate hunting pheasants knowing that the stocking truck just went in the field so you know i don't want to step on anybody's toes that's just my two cents because you know it would be cool to have pheasants you know last a little bit longer on these game lands in just you know two days so but you know i hope you guys enjoyed that you know quick little pheasant hunt the quickest hunt of the year so you know outdoor tech out peace